Josie Bird, welcome back to Pokemon Mystery Dungeon Rescue Team DX. In the last episode, of course, we were able to build our brand new base with a bunch of friends, and on top of that, a new rescue team has emerged out of leading members of other rescue teams to go and save, or at least see what's going on with Alkazam and stuff, because they've been fighting Groudon, we don't know what's happening, earthquakes are happening all of the time, so it's a bit of a wild situation right now. So we'll see what ends up happening for that. I don't know if I need to store anything right now, so we're just gonna find out together. Um, if there's anything I maybe wanna put away. Uh, maybe a couple of these seeds would be good just to sort of put away. Um, and that should be good, 24 out of 48. I don't know how much money I have at the moment, but we definitely wanna get that nice and organized as well. Actually, I don't. Okay, so we're good. We're, I, I'm guessing that means we're good just to head in because we also reached Gold League last episode, which is super exciting. So I guess for today's episode, we're just focused on getting more stuff done until other things happen. So Frosty Forest, there are seven different quests here and there's also the strong foe Spinda, as well as a good collection of other Pokemon, none of which we have. So even if we just get one new Pokemon here, that's gonna be really good because we don't have them, <laughs> guaranteed. Uh, so we're heading to Frosty Forest. Haven't really spent too much time here, so this will definitely be interesting. Uh, and, uh, we're, yeah, we have Squad Up going on. Where do I wanna go? It looks like there's a Kecleon shop over there. Maybe at some point we can make our way over. But uh, I'm mostly just focused on the quests and stuff. Ooh, we could actually go down right now if we wanted to. Uh, hello, oh no, using the slam on me. This is an Azuril, so that should be super effective. Yes, it is. Okay, not bad. I'll at least go down this way and get whatever item this could be. So I, I wanna explore the most of everything, but I haven't gone to a single shop where I'm like, I need that a certain item. So I think that might just be better just to move on to the next one, especially if there's no quests to do here in this floor. Uh, let's move to floor number two. Uh, and there's Magby. And also this Pokemon, which I don't think we've gone against too much. Uh, we'll see how they go here. Ooh, his Water Pulse is upgraded. We'll do Razor Leaf on this guy, and the Furret fainted. <laughs> That's such a cute name, Furret. So yeah, let's immediately move over to the Magby, who was right here. Azrael used Water Sport. Where's Azrael? I don't know. Uh, you found the Magby you were looking for, awesome. And as easy as that, we get our first job of seven completed. So there's still six more to go. Uh, so we're just gonna you know, keep moving through all of this. And let's keep going. So, here's a Snorunt. Nice, nice move there. Uh, actually, yeah, I might go for the Azurel or not. It just changed its mind. I guess we can't reach the Azurel. Now we can. Sludge Bomb, super effective. One hit takedown, and I think we just gotta level up. Now George gotta level up, he's level 29. Not bad. Uh, just in time, level up. Going down this way, got another Snorunt. There we go, pretty good. And plenty of items to get around here, so I might wanna try for some of these. We still haven't caught our first Pokemon yet. So I'd like to change that. Come on, get him. Uh, yeah, again, sure. There we go. What about up this way? There's a sleeping Azrael. I got gotcha. you. That might be a one hit takedown, especially if it doubles up like that, wow. And what about you over here, another little, uh, was it ferret? It, well, that's the actual real life animal, a ferret with a U. All right. Here is some coins, George will grab it. Okay, so we're good to leave. That was floor two. So we have at least six more floors to get through, at the minimum. Um, okay. Oh, it's a Rhyhorn. So that's just straight upwards. That shouldn't be too bad to do that. Um, we can get a, a berry there, an orange berry. Oh, got the doubled up attack with a critical hit. Good job, George. Oh no. The Azrael's a bit of a problem, but none of us really have fire type moves, so I'm not really worried about that. Got some super effective hits there. Now we got the Furret. Hit him with the Razor Leaf and the Water Pulse. They just keep lining up if you want. There we go. Super effective, the Pillow Swine. Got it, and let's talk to you. Hey, you found the Rhyhorn you were looking for, so there is mission number two done. And we're sort of storming through it pretty quickly. I don't know what our chances are of getting you know, past Gold League in today's episode. I don't think very high whatsoever, but I want to sort of get as far as I can. You know, that's the main goal, I guess. Because honestly, like story-wise, we're sort of just waiting around to see what happens with Alkazam's team. Beyond that, we're at this sort of limbo point in the game. It's a little weird. So, we get right next to the staircase, but we need to go to the Slugma, which is in another room over that way. Okay, they're using bubble, <laughs> three damage. Not very effective at all. Boom, that uh does a lot, quite a lot, but still not a single Pokemon. 
Well, there's a nose pass. We'll get you in a moment. First, try that out a bit. And go for you. You're looking an early attack on you before you can even uh, wake up. Just like that. Cool. So up this way, there is the Slugma, was it? Yep, Slugma saved. That is mission number three done. Pretty good so far. Four more to go. So, next up, I just wanna get these items and we'll go back to the staircase that we've already found. Got it. We are getting a little low on hunger. Gonna have to work on that soon. But for right now, we should just be fine for moving over this way and going down. All right, yep, I like to go on. Oh, there's a fainted Pokemon on this floor. Go up to the Pokemon and give it an apple. I know what that is, I just forget its name. It has the weird mouth on the back of it. I don't like it very much, but hey, if we could get it as a Pokemon, that'd be awesome. Um, for right now though, let's save this Azrael, or not save this Azrael, take out this Azrael so that we can save that one Pokemon. Ready? Gotcha, 93 damage, do a little bit more. Awesome. And you, oh boy. Nice. And what's going on down this way? We got the staircase out, we have the ethers, and I'll give you an apple. Give you just a normal apple, I don't need to give you a big one. Nice, it was a Mawile, recover from feigning. Moved by Zebrater, Zebrater's goodwill. Nice, we have the Echo Cave, so absolutely join us, Mawile. That's a cool Pokemon to get. Funnel fun. The rate at which HP restores naturally when Pokemon are in a corridor is greatly sped up. Rare qualities affect your whole team. So we're not low on hunger at the, or low on health at the moment, but if we were in a corridor just like that one, we'd be fine. Oh no, we're sleeping. Thank you for the coins. <laughs> okay, so I just definitely want to take on this Azrael real quick. And then we're getting out of here. Oh, does Azrael want to join us? Oh no, okay. It just wasn't letting me move the way I was trying to move there. Here's a nose pass. Get rid of him as well. Double Razor Leaf. Okay, go up the stairs. We've saved four people so far, so we only have three more to go. And it's a little neat arena. So that is all the way on the top, so going up this way is probably our best bet. Watch out for that. Ready? Got it. Nice. So we get ourselves another uh, Max Ether, an Orenberry. But over here. Got it. What do we got here? Um, a tiny reviver seed. Uh, so there's two more Pokemon. Try to focus on the Azuril first. Or, or okay, we got a Psyduck doing the job for us. Everybody is just beating them up for me. They're awesome. Okay, Nidorino, I got gotcha. you. There's only two more to go after this. That's awesome. We're chipping through it. I need to take my own apple though, uh, because we're down to 23 hunger. A bit of a problem. Yep, I'd like to keep going. Eat an apple real quick. Thank you very much. Because our teammates like don't ever run out of hunger. I wonder if I should maybe switch to them when I'm running out of hunger. Maybe that'd be better. Hold on, I'm not trying to talk to you, I'm trying to fight. There we go. Very good. Still no more friends joining up with us though. Sort of a shame. Actually, I wanna go this way. No, all right. That staircase has to be around somewhere. Here it is. We're leaving. All right, floor seven F. The sixth person is here. There's a fainted Pokemon on this floor. Go to the Pokemon and give it an apple. I would love to. Whoa, okay, so we got a, uh, what is this called again? Houndoom, not a Houndoom. A Mightyena. Nice. So it looks like another item over here while we're on our way over to our Little friend. There's somebody behind us, we'll just keep moving for right now. Boodoo can't go on because of hunger. Yep, we'll give him an apple. But I'm getting a bit worried if the next person needs an apple to give them a big one. Uh, oh, do you wanna join us as well? Of course, uh, Bo Plains, we got that, so awesome. Sales pitch. Items can be sold at a higher price to shops and dungeons. Rare qualities affect your whole team. Cool. So there's that. Uh, oh yeah, get that nose pass. Nice job. The teamwork. So our team is starting to fill up a little bit, but not by any Pokemon naturally that we're finding in the dungeon. It's all by the missions. So that's a little bit different. I don't even know if Mawile and Boodoo are Pokemon you can find normally around here. Okay, so that was actually all just a dead end. So there's only two more rooms where it could possibly be. 
So it must be the last one I checked, of course. Actually, no, there's, oh no, there's still more to the right. Never mind. Oh no, there's two nose passes. Not bad. I used a razor leaf against this guy, super effective. Nice. So could it be up this way? Yep. Let's get more nose passes. And there we go, we get a level up for me, maybe? Yep, level 34. Cool. And take you out real quick. Oh, we're doing 93 damage now. So yep, I would like to go on. I hope that the last person we need to save is here, but oh, they're not actually. So we'll have to do at least one more four. Got it. It's crazy how many of these guys we've taken out, but yet none of them want to join us. Okay, he's trying to rest, but it won't be enough. Where in the world could we have to go for the staircase? This area looks huge. I'll just go to the rooms with items for right now and see if we can get lucky, but it might not work out. Oh no, another uh, Mighty Anna. And another Nose Pass. You guys got him, right? I hope so. Nice. Yep, that's definitely gonna be it. Is there another one behind us? There is. <laughs> Ooh, we get a Mock Ribbon. And then down this way, some coins. We are still looking for the exit. Where in the world is it? So we're getting hungry again. Oh, that's a problem. Because I can eat this, but now if anybody else needs an apple, I might be in trouble. Okay, so they're fighting somebody. That's fine. Where in the world is the exit? Okay, we're missing. There we go. So I don't think there's a room over this way. So our best bet is to go down and then over to the left. I gotcha. Hiya. They're resting. Not on my watch. Here it is, the last room we checked. But this seems to be a running theme. Let's hope that the last person we need to save is here. Yes, they are. All right, so it's a Rattata. They're right next to the staircase, but that won't actually matter much. And it didn't say that they were fainted, so we don't need to give them an apple. Ow. Okay, we're all riled up. Got him. And what do we got going on over this way? A sleeping mighty Anna. Gonna get taken down in maybe one hit. Well, we got an extra hit in there just for good measure. Get the extra orange berry. I wanna take whatever extra opportunity I can get here to get more Pokemon. So let's take you on. Nice, and then a nose pass. Gotcha. Oh, very good. So no new Pokemon from the ones we actually naturally beat it up, or had beaten up. Very cool that we got the Rotata at the least, but I don't know. We was hoping for more Pokemon out of that, but still two new ones. Uh, so that should be everybody. There is a, okay, maybe I miscounted. Never mind. there's still a request. Oh yeah, I guess so. Oh, what's happening here? Heart of the Frosty Forest, 10F. The music changed, and then there's another faint in Mawile, but no, I don't have the item for it. I don't have an apple, I just used one. So, for right now, I have to look around and see if, aha, here we go. So just turn around and go. I guess I'll take on the Rhyhorn. There we go. So while you guys are fighting, yep, give an apple. <laughs> I'm glad they at least put one on the level. All right, then we stop Marwell from fainting, and they also want to join us. They have Notorious Restoration. Okay, so with that, we just have to find the staircase. It's interesting, it doesn't give you the option to leave. What is this guy? Oh, is it a Metagross, I think? A Metang, which I think evolves into a Metagross. Okay, so now we just gotta find the exit in probably the last room we check. Great. What's in here? We get some coins. And then over this way, Ah, here we go, I'm out of here. See ya, I'd like to go on. Well actually, yeah how do I, there's still more though. There's a fainted Pokemon on this floor, I need another apple. Did I miscount or something? I don't know, I guess I had to have. So I don't have an apple for you just yet. That's a problem, you're sleeping, so I might as well take you down. 
and we'll move to the right because there's two items over that way. As long as long as one of them could be an apple, we should be fine. But I mean, unless that. Oh, I do have an apple. Okay, I guess I just my inventory wasn't organized. Well, I can turn around in a moment then. Uh, let's take on this guy. Who is this? I don't know this Pokemon. It's a Lairon, huh? Not familiar with that. So we'll go back. We actually already have an apple, so we should be fine. Here's the exit as well. Critical hit there, very nice. Keep moving back. And hey, I got you an apple. Swablu. Awesome, yay, Swablu recovered. Maybe a Swablu, maybe these, when you feed them an apple, maybe this isn't like a mission. They have Steamroll, cool. But that's still another new Pokemon I definitely don't have. But yeah, that's so weird. I guess that doesn't actually count as a mission. Because it doesn't say job completed. Grounded, the Pokemon is knocked to the ground so ground type moves can hit it. The Pokemon can't move in the air either. The status wears off after a while or if the Pokemon uses Flyer Bounce. I guess it happened with the Swablu. That's fine. We're good, we'll just keep moving over this way. Okay, they're still fighting over there. Okay, let's, no wait, I wanted to move just like that. Because I think we're full on teammates at this point, so if we could just get what we need and go. Pseudo Wudo. So I, I don't know how many more missions we actually have left. I'm a little curious now. Um, status, accept the jobs. I guess we have two more Frosty Forests to do. Wow, so 12 up and 13 up. So we're on 12 up right now. So now I know what to do, okay. That's so weird that these little give an apple to rescue them missions don't actually count. Anyways, we'll go ahead and save you. Job completed, send you back and everything. Yep, yep, yep. And now this guy over here, I'll take him on. Awesome. So where could the exit be? Oh, we get some extra rocks. Whoa, oh, it's a ditto. Okay, can we get the ditto? That'd be awesome. Because we've only run into a ditto before when we couldn't actually get it. But no, we didn't get it this time either. That's a shame. But hey, maybe in the future. A mill tank, interesting. I don't think I've seen a mill tank in the game yet. So let's take this guy on, the Matang. But at this point, I'm all in, just focused on getting to the person we need to save. As soon as we can do that, we can just get out of here. So don't worry, Mill Tank. I'll become the savior. Oh, wow. Somebody got a level up, probably Mike, if I had to guess. Yep, he is level 27 now. Grab that stuff. Another enemy down this way, another Matang. Okay. Get him. I missed, really. That's a shame. Keeps on beating up our Swablu. Gotcha. Okay, no, I didn't want to get you. Whatever, if it works, it works. Let's talk to you. Yeah, you found the mill tank. Whew, that was a lot of work. So, that should be everybody properly saved now. Yes, I would like to exit the dungeon. We get four or three new Pokemon, right? Uh, but we'll, four of them in total, so we'll get rid of one of the Mawiles. Uh, so we successfully completed the job at Mount Freeze, we get a rainbow gummy, and that's it. So a level 22 Mawile, they have Funnel Fun. I'll keep that one. Yep. But then the other Mawile I'm going to send away. Nope. So here's Badu, definitely uh, keep you as well. Uh, no nickname. Mawile again. Nope, let's see how many coins you give us. 307, not too bad. And then Swablu. So I'm glad we've already gotten three new Pokemon in today's episode. Hopefully we get more as we are thanked for all of our work for getting those seven missions done. So here's Rhyhorn, he is going to give us a perfect apple and a perfect apple. 75 points and 200 coins. That's cool, so this is our first job done under the gold ranking. And here's Afiro and uh, Slugma. Rainbow Gummy, Fierce Bandana, 200 coins. Not too bad. See, we should have a good chunk of cash to put away after this. Tauros and Mill Tank, Max Elixir and Perfect Apple. 
175 points for that one. Yeah, he was on the, uh, or she was on the final floor that we were on there, so. Makes sense that that one was a little bit more difficult. Raticate and Rattata, Bam Seed and Perfect Apple. Pretty good. And we got Magmar, or Mag B, which evolves into Magmar. Uh, cover Band, 75 points, 200 coins. Yeah, we, we have a while for Gold League. But we'll just ship through it. Ditto, <laughs> Ditto and, uh, and Sudo Wudo. Will either of these guys join us? I don't think so, but it would be cool if they did. And then we got Nidorino, which we definitely don't have a Nidorino, so if they want to join too, that'd be awesome. But no, not really. Okay, so there's all seven missions done. We did good today. Let's knock off and call it a night. See you tomorrow. Yeah, that was a lot of fun. A lot of work, but a lot of fun. The next morning, we wake up and we're ready to do more. Oh no, earthquakes. Oh, another earthquake? There have been so many quakes lately. I wonder when they'll settle down. Zebra, there's a commotion down at the square. A lot of Pokemon have already gathered there. Let's go to the square right now. Uh-oh. Hey, Lombre, what's up here? Hey, George Whitwell. You should just go and see for yourself. Oh, no! Look, it's Blastoise and the others. Shiftry, what's going on here? They were wiped out in the underground dungeon. You're kidding. Urgh, that place. It's rough, seriously. We couldn't get far enough to even see Crowdon. I don't ever wanna go back to a place that bad. I think that's the voice I gave him. Underground. It's far worse than we had imagined. <laughs> oh no, this guy again. What fools. That's what you get for trying to be, to, to do, for trying the impossible. Gengar, what are you talking about? Why don't you shut up? This is about saving Alakazam's team. We have to try. <laughs> you really, you really find thinking hard, don't you? Even they look smart compared to you. It's too much. Even Blastoise went down. It's got to be awful, though. Who'd want to go into a dungeon that dangerous? There's no way I can't. I, I can't go. I burn too easily. I can't take earthquakes. It'd be like going and knowing full well we'd get wiped. Everyone. You see, even they finally seem to understand their situation. <laughs> I don't see what's so funny about it. I, my leafy fans would burn up. Even Shift Tree. <laughs> get over it. Don't expect to be rewarded just because you tried. Sometimes it's better to wise up and give up. No, it's not. Huh? Did I say something profound? <laughs> Uh, Zebra, I don't know anymore. What should we do? Even if it's impossible, should we still try to rescue Alakazam? Let's go! Yeah, yeah, you're right. All right, Zebra. Everyone listen. We're going to rescue Alakazam's team. What? What did they say? <laughs> hey, who are they? Can't say I know them. It's Team Zebra heard. They're well known around these parts. Team Zebra heard? You mean that lot that were suspected of involvement in the Ninetales legend? I heard about that. Weren't they living at like fugitives until recently? Can they handle it? They don't look very tough. Sure, the rescue might be too much for us to handle, but we're still a rescue team. I wanted to help Pokemon that were suffering from the natural disasters. That's why we started up a rescue team. That's why I want to rescue Alkazam's team more than anything. Never giving up, that's what Team Zebra Herd takes pride in, that's for sure. <laughs> you really aren't very bright, are you? Why don't you do like everyone else and wise up? No, George is right. <laughs> that's right, I wasn't thinking straight out of fear. <laughs> we all forgot the most important thing, we are rescue teams, pride. We have it too, pride as rescuers. <laughs> have you lost your senses? Why would you listen to that clown and worse, be persuaded? Why go if you're facing certain defeat? Is that so? Okay, we've only failed once. Blastoise, this is, this is no time to be lying around. <laughs> yes, no more wallowing in woe is me self-pity. If we give up, that that's how it ends, not for me. 
Octillery and Golem too. Ugh, you lot, that wasn't the tune you were whistling just a little. Aye, that's right. They're, they've got to be with, there's got to be ways that we can get through. If we all pull together, we'll be sure to find a way. We'll conquer the dungeon by having all the rescue teams cooperate. Hey, Rogue! Ugh, are you dreaming? Don't say I didn't warn you when you get into a world of pain. All right, we'll see ya. I don't know why he just wants to bring everybody down. What is that gonna solve? Thank you, George. You stopped us from throwing away the most important thing we have, pride. Many thanks from all of us. Everyone, it's time to get to work. Let's show them what we rescue teams are really about. Hey, all right. So I guess we won't be doing it alone. We got held up by the trouble we had with Gengar. But now we're finally going off to the underground dungeon. I know we're not leaving till tomorrow, but I'm like buzzing with excitement. We should spend the day today getting ready. Let me know when you're ready to roll. So it looks like we're still going to just go back to uh, preparing and everything. Oh, hey, you ready to roll? Not yet. All right, I'll be I'll right here until you're ready. Give me a shout when you're ready. Okay, so we definitely want to organize our inventory and stuff. Uh, I have quite a lot of stuff right now. I don't really know what we're gonna end up needing, so I don't mind if we, uh... oh, I, I, I always thought you weren't the ordinary sort. I'll keep your valuables under my watchful eye. You can go out and fight without worrying about them. Uh, so let's definitely store some stuff though. Um, I'm thinking we can uh, organize our inventory like that. Probably don't need the Geo Pebbles or the Mock Ribbon. I probably don't need more than three Max Ethers or three Oran Berries. I have a lot more than that, maybe four, so I'll do that. Okay. Once again with these Reviver Seeds, or a bunch of seeds, really. Um, I don't need the Link Boxes, that's for sure. So there we go, there's a lot of stuff put away. I need to go and get some apples out, though. Um, Cause I don't have any right now. So let's take out some apples. We got lots of stuff, as you can see. Uh, we have some tiny apples. We have a lot of normal apples, though. So I will get out, I'll get out four of them. And then, if I could just get out, say, three big apples. I know we're, we're filling up our inventory a lot here, but I don't know how tough the, the thing we're about to go on is gonna be. Uh, and then on top of that, let's see how much money we have right now. I really don't know. Uh, your money will be jealously guarded, so feel free to secure on, on your surroundings. So feel secure on your surroundings. So I have $3,000 on top of the 10,900 we have. That's almost enough for the next place, but not quite yet. And we get an orange berry for our troubles. Awesome. I don't know if I should take extra missions. I don't even know really where we're going. Um, so I don't think it's worth it, but hey, why not? Uh, I don't know which ones. I'll just take all of them. There we go. <laughs> awesome. So that's really cool. We're going to hop back over to it and I guess tell George that we're ready to go. Hey, are you all ready to roll? All set? All right, I'll, wait, no. Sorry, <laughs> press the wrong button. Yep, all set. All right, all set. We should get a good night's sleep then. We'll roll out tomorrow. Okay. I'm a bit nervous, to be honest with you. I, I don't know how our character is sleeping so soundly. Oh, we're dreaming too. I'm in that dream again. Gardevoir, it's tomorrow, isn't it? That you take that to that underground dungeon? Yes, they make it sound like one terrible place. I wonder if we'll be okay. You'll be fine. I'm certain that you will succeed, Zebra. You have my support, please, go with strength. I will, thank you. I'm feeling a little braver now. I'll, I will go for it. By the way, Gardevoir, do you know what it's like underground? Or what Groudon is like? No, I'm sorry to say, I can't envision it. Okay, I thought maybe you knew something, the way you said it. No, I only wanted to give you encouragement. I'm sorry. No, no, that's fine too. I'm happy you tried to cheer me up, thank you. There is one thing I can, can foresee, huh? Your role is coming to its end, little by little. My role is ending? You became a Pokemon in order to fulfill a certain role, and that role brought you here. Now that role is finally drawing to its conclusion. Gardevoir, tell me, what is my role? Why did I become a Pokemon? When the time comes, I think I can tell you when this adventure is finished. Au revoir. All right, well, thank you for the information I could get at the least. The next morning. Oh boy, here we go. 
Let's move out. I'm very nervous. This is not gonna be an easy journey. Oh, hi George. Morning Zebra, get a good night's sleep? This is it. Let's give it our best and rescue Alakazam and his team. Gardevoir said, she will tell me everything when this adventure is over. Is going underground the adventure she meant? Will she tell me if we rescue Alakazam's team? Hey! What, are you stunned? Let's go already! Okay, let's get a move on. Do I just go down this way? I guess so, Magma Cavern is now open for exploration. All right, awesome. Okay, so Magma Cavern, here we go. It's gonna bring our normal team and hope for the best. It never really gives us requirements on like what level we should be or anything, so I can only hope that we're powerful enough. So this is it, the underground cavern where Groudon is. Look at all the flowing streams of lava. It wouldn't surprise me if the dungeon is scorching hot. Other rescue teams should already be inside. Let's get in there and give it our best. I'm very worried. Oh yeah, Magma Cavern B1F. Oh, we already got a Sandshrew waiting for us. Let's take him on. Yeah, I'm not gonna be very good against Sandshrew, but George should be. And that was enough to take him out, good. Uh, down this way, we have ourselves a wand. Ooh, we got a uh, TM, a roar TM. I don't know if we've ever found just a TM sitting on the floor like that. Very interesting. And I don't know if we can actually find Pokemon that'll join up with us here, but we'll certainly try for, oh, you're confused now. Use that Razor Leaf. Good stuff. So over this way, what do we got in terms of an item? I'm not going to go super far out of my way to fight everybody because of the case. I really don't know if we can even recruit them on our team right now. So if I could save my energy, my my move power, all of it, that'd be great. Got it, okay. You can keep doing signal beam on that guy if you want. Oh, the hunger trap, that's not good. Okay, I was not expecting this to be another hallway. Okay, so we're on the right track. Oh, that was a critical hit and super effective. Okay, never mind. I thought that we weren't super effective against Sand Slash. Uh, so who's over this way? Sleeping Raticate. Once again, let's not worry about them. Let's save our move energy as much as we can. Okay, so we're going deeper and deeper underground now, B2F. There's an item over this way. I'm gonna go where the items are and hope that it also leads me to the staircase, you know? There's a water pulse, but he missed it. So we went from a very freezing mountain now to a very hot cavern. Very big difference, isn't it? In all sorts of variety today. Oh wow, this is a, a middle queen. All right, you guys got it, that's good. All right, and what about inside of here? Oh gosh. Keep getting them. You got it. Good job. And two more items waiting for us. Luckily, no enemies. Just the items. So there's some coins. If you guys want to grab it for me? I appreciate it. And here's a wand. Aha! Here's the exit. So I don't know if you'll be able to take out that Raticate, but while you're trying, I'll just go to the staircase. But you were able to do it. That's good. The problem is we're already halfway down on our hunger, which is why I'm glad we got so many apples. Uh, oh no! Magnemite was on fire there. Gotta be careful not to go over the lava, buddy. This is a big room. George noticed that the team member is burned. Yeah, use the Rossberry. Maybe we should have brought more of those? I don't know. Whoa, okay, we have a, uh, I forget what this is called, a Graveler. Whoa, he ran right at me. My gosh. There we go, at least we got rid of him. Over this way, there's a Nidoqueen queen and another Golem. He bad it. Uh, oh wow! Very cool critical hit there. Good job, George. So we get some extra coins. Oh, stats up. Oh, this is a Nitto King. I would like to attack him, but this angle is not working out for me. That's okay. That's super effective as well. Ow! That hurt. Good stuff. Grab these extra coins, and I will move over to this room. No staircase. Oh. What did you find? Revive all orb, that's very useful. And look at this, the staircase, oh no. But a Nitto King's coming in. Oh, you guys got it really quick. Let's keep going. Magma Cavern B4F, oh no. Nitto Queen is waiting for me right away, Nitto King. 
Oh no, bad time to be confused. I hope they can get him, maybe. No, attacking the wrong way. Get him, Magnemite. Yeah, good job. So they don't have too much health, actually. Lots of items on this floor, four different items. Here's Nuno Queen again. Nice. Oh, definitely I can get rid of the Golem in one hit. But I didn't this time. Sometimes I can. I'll grab that. Oh no, what was that about? Oh my gosh. I don't know what that was. Uh, HP is very low. He didn't get taken out though. So yeah, definitely use an Orenberry. Wow, that was crazy. I don't know really what happened there. If that was just like an earthquake kind of thing. I'm a bit worried though. Luckily, everybody should heal over time. Uh, ouch, but I can take a lot more than this. Didn't mean to talk to him, but I'm glad he, he's pepping himself up. So George and I will heal over time, but I definitely want to use an apple, if I can. There we go, plenty of apples. Let's eat one. Aha, here's the staircase. We're taking it, we're just gonna leave. Next floor, Magma Cavern, B5F. Someone wants to grab those coins, ow. So that has to be Earthquake or something. I'm a little bit closer to this guy. Nice, one hit takedown. Oh no, slow trap. That should be fine. I'm just a bit worried. Okay, we're back to normal speed. So what's down this way? Is this just a big hallway? It sort of kind of is. Rock polish. Oh boy. Whoa. I don't like how he can do that. You guys are taking him out super quick. Whoa. Hold on. Um, yeah, do a diagonal move like that. Hopefully they do the same. They do. Very good. It's very tricky. Oh, we got a sparkling floor. We got a totter orb. And here we go. The exit and also a little seed. It was a stun seed. I'm moving. We're back at the full health now. If we could just keep moving with this. Another TM on the floor. Oh no. Here he goes again. Turn to him and hit him with the razor leaf. Critical hit, super effective, but not enough to take him out. This should be, maybe, yeah. So my best bet is to go up to where the item is and hope that there's a staircase, there's not. Lots of enemies on this floor though. So if I could get lucky, that'd be fantastic. Come on, get you. critical hit. Uh, oh no, it was enough to take you out. Weird. Hmm. Oh, get rid of the Sand Slash. Not bad, oh, that's Sand Shrew. See ya, and here's the staircase. So I don't know how deep we're supposed to be going right now. I'm just trying my best. Magma Cavern B7F. This is definitely the most intense mission we've been on yet. Oh, you dropped a uh, box there. That was a pretty box. Oh, and this is what, a Golbat? Zubat, no, Zubat's the smaller one. This is it a Crobat? Interesting. Oh no, ow, rude. Now you got me all riled up though, you're in trouble. So no, uh, no exit on this floor, but there is another item. Got it. Back over this way. What do we got going on? Not too much yet. It has to be around here though. Aha, here it is, see ya. Not gonna deal with anything else there. Oh, it's getting a lot more craggly now. As we get deeper and deeper. Will it tell me anywhere how deep I have to go? I don't think it would tell me here. Yeah. Weird. Okay, so we'll just have to keep going and hoping it's not too deep. Aha, we got lucky with this one. Just take the opportunity while I can get it. B9F. Got some rocks to throw. Actually, we should do some of that now. Uh, register it, so that our teammates can just throw those whenever necessary. That's always useful. Oh, there's something. Oh, here's a Magmar. We also got a Heal Seed. Eat a Heal Seed to heal off all bad statuses. Uh, this awesome seed will cure any bad status just like that. Cool. One size fits all kind of thing. Ow, the smog. Not so fun to deal with. Uh, we'll just get you going Sludge Bomb. Took you out. Maybe I should have gone the other way, I don't know. Here's another one. Waiting for George to hit him with some water. That would help. 
Not happening yet, though. A little weird. So this room doesn't have much in it for us. Uh, we're getting hungry. Oh, it's an Arbok. Don't see that too often. Um, see, so yeah, let's just have a quick apple. Nothing in here. Jeez, where is it at? Maybe it really is in the room with the item. Okay, that was a one-hit takedown. Aha, it is in the room with the item. Okay, are we getting this guy? Good job, critical hit, double attack and everything. I'm going to keep moving. B10F now. Whew, it's more and more intense the deeper we go. Another Magmar, hitting him with the sludge bomb and the water gun, super effective. Thank you for that. Oh no. I don't know who this is gonna be. It's gonna be an Arbok again. He's a very big snake. Uh, frozen. The Pokemon is frozen solid and can't do anything. The status wears off after a while when the ice melts, or it can wear off if the Pokemon is hit by a fire type move. The ice also sometimes breaks when taking damage, and the status may wear off that way. Ice type Pokemon won't get the status. So I guess I'm frozen at the moment. That's a problem. Um. Not the heal seed for this one. You guys can take him out. He's not very high on health. Yeah, there we go. So two items on this way, they're both coins. Uh, I'll let you get him. And then, there's no, I guess these are all just connecting hallways. Weird. Get rid of you. Nice, no, that missed, really, wow. Fire spin. The Pokemon is trapped in swirling flames and is unable to move from this from its spot. It also keeps taking damage. The status throws off after a while or when the Pokemon warps or gets blown away. That's sort of painful. So hopefully we can get out of here soon after I take damage for a little bit. Hmm. Oh no. What are you fighting now? You're throwing iron spikes at him? That's another Arbok. That was good though. Oh, this place is huge, it just keeps going. So what about over this way then? Aha, here we go, I don't have to explore the rest of it, thank goodness. Magma Cavern B11F. Immediately Magmar's just chilling here. Get the sludge bomb on him, the devil. And we get a level up, I think, for George. Yep, he's level 30. Wow, he's catching up to me, actually. So he reached a big 3-0, that's cool. I'll go for this item on the right first. Just some extra coins. Don't know how many coins we'll end up getting out of all this because there's not any missions and we're not sending any Pokemon home because we're not actually uh, recruiting any of them. So that'll be interesting to see. In the meantime though, I just gotta find the exit. Oh no. Oh, Spark. Got him? Got him, good. Oh no. Don't know who you're fighting now, but we just gotta keep going. Oh no, now it's getting really crowded. This is a problem. 84 damage on him, that one hit takedown. No, but I land on the hunger trap. Get rid of you, eat an apple. Oh, actually, so they can join us. We just have been very unlucky, so definitely get an Arbok on our team. That sounds wonderful. Wow. Um, eat an apple real fast. Very good. Let's try this way. Aha. There's a Magmar way down here. Yeah, use Water Pulse on him. That should be enough to get rid of him. He doesn't want to join our team, but we picked up something. I didn't see what. Magma Cavern B12F. Oh, okay, we got a Slugma. Boom. So Mag, Mag Cargo, so that is actually, I guess the evolution of that one. All right then, try again. There we go, critical hit. It wasn't very effective, but it was effective enough. So there's a lot going on here, but maybe I just wanna make my way towards the exit. Uh, exit. Uh, just trying to take you on now. Oh, there's some stones over this way. Come on, oh, not bad, not bad. Oh, don't use Leer on me. Good enough. Grab these stones, and we are heading out of here. Yep, I'd like to go on. I don't know how much farther we have to go. I can't imagine it's too much more, right? 
I mean, at this rate, they'll probably give us one of those Kangaskhan break areas. That would be nice. Hmm. Got ourselves an ether over this way. But we could just keep going. Maybe I'll grab whatever this is, just some extra coins. Oh no, it's in the mawile. Ow, no. Okay, no, it was just fake tears. Not very effective though. Fairy wind, that hurts. Okay, oh, now Ma wants to join us. We'll probably send you away for coins, but hey, in the meantime, you can give us some extra firepower. Yeah, now beat up this other Arbok. Very good moves. Ow. Arbok seems to have like every uh, element to their disposal. Yep, I don't to go on. 14F now. There's a fainted Pokemon on this floor, so this just sort of happens all the time now. It's a little, a little uh, sun Pokemon. Hmm. Okay, so here's the Mag Cargo. Wow, that hurt. Especially, it was fire against grass, so that can be painful. Ooh. Okay, well, we got rid of him. I desperately need some uh, health now. We have a bunch of Oran Berries, as you can see. So we should be fine with just eating one. Yep, back to full. Not full, well, actually, yeah, it's full. So I definitely wanna make my way over to the Pokemon in need, because that'll be a guaranteed new friend to join us, and that's awesome. But no, uh, no exit just yet. Soul Rock, let's give you an apple. I hope you like it. Oh, we don't have Mount Moon View though. That stinks. Well, in the meantime, we can uh, have you get us coins. You can help us out a little bit. Use Yawn. So we became drowsy. Not good. Arbok knows the team member has fallen ill. Don't use the heal seat. I, I, there will be a time when I need it. I just don't think that time is now. Yeah, we're fine. Okay, we're asleep. They're gonna move over. Don't use the heal seat on me. I'm fine. Yeah, you guys can attack this Mala while I'm, on, while I'm snoozing. Water gun was upgraded, good job. So no shop in this one. Not shop, but exit. <laughs> you know what I mean. Let's get you. Not too bad. Aha, here's the exit. Let's just get to it. 15F now. It just doesn't stop, my gosh. Aha, oh, this one was very lucky though. Get rid of you as soon as we can. And then we're going. Yep. I would love to have those items, but I'd love to make progress more. So I'm going to guess that, oh, we got a, a wheezing here. Um, well, that was a coughing, which evolves into wheezing. But I'm going to guess that the exit is where both of those items are, because that would be convenient. So that's what I'm hoping for. It's not quite, and they're both coins. Hmm. Here's another coughing. Got him. Oh, and he wants to join us. Sure. We have the poison swamp, but we don't have you, so that sounds like a good combo to me. They have riled up, which is also nice. We already have riled up. I don't know if that'll stack, if there'll be like multiple instances of it. Hmm. Gotcha. Okay. Over this way, aha! We found the exit, we just gotta get rid of another Mawile. A little bit more. Uh, maybe I should try the, uh, the the thing. There we go. <laughs> that works out pretty well. I'll let it go on. Magma Cavern B17F. So at this point, I desperately need more food. So we're going to get one of the big apples. On myself. It should fill us up all the way. Yep, a full 100. I don't know what the perfect apple will do then if this really does everything we need it to, you know? Oh, there's two Pokemon. That's sort of a problem. I need to start using some elixirs. Ow. Oof. Not good. Well, we are definitely getting riled up from it, so that's at least something. That does a lot of damage to us out. We're on fire now, too. Uh, Okay, we can try the heal seed this time. Lava Plume, don't put me on fire immediately again. That would sink. So. Let's get an ether and give it to one of my moves. Uh, we'll do, no, not that one. Okay, well, that one was almost down anyways, but not the one I wanted to do. Uh, 
because we have a couple of these now, so I can just drink up with another one on my Razor Leaf. I wanna help with the other teammates, but for right now, I think my moves are the most important because we are the more powerful team member. Okay, they defeated the coughing. I just need to find the exit. I don't know who's fighting what there, but they seem to survive. Exits around somewhere. Oh, what did they find? Revive all orb. That's actually cool. What about this way? No? Get an ether though. Aha! Here it is! Awesome! And let's try this out. 18F. Are we gonna get like 20 floors deep here? So there's another fainted Pokemon. The problem now is I'm running out of apples and I do need some for myself. So there's that. There's another item over this way. Is it an apple? It's an Orenberry. Guess I'm taking out this guy as well. Nice. Oh no, they're doing amnesia. Their special defense went up sharply. That's fine, actually. We got a Joy Ribbon, and now we have a, uh, a Cloyster. So here's a big apple. Make the most of it. I don't have many of those. So definitely, we don't have Bountiful Sea, but we'll take ya. Uh, mind of a matter, there's not enough room? Or, no. No, no, okay. I was thinking it was saying that there was not a camp for him to go in. That's fine. It's still a new person on our team. I think our team is all maxed out now, so if we have to do anything, I guess it'll have to be replacing probably like Mawile. Oh, and here's the exit. Very good, very good. I'm not even going to battle, ba bother battling you because I need to save my move power. Oh, it's the moon thing. So I'm guessing along with the sun guy, he is going to uh, be a part of, I think it was Mount Moonshine. Maybe not then. I will, I, yeah, I guess if this, it, it is a moon looking Pokemon. Who knows? Uh, was that what it was called though? I don't remember. Uh, Lunatone. Uh, let's go ahead and give you an apple. Once again, make the most of it. Mount Moon View, okay. Uh, just because, you know, sun and moon, I just figured it was, you know, shining, but okay. Uh, there are too many Pokemon. We're going to replace Mawile since we already have one back home. No, 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 yeah. <laughs> it's also the lowest level, I think, so. Uh, let's go this way. Aha, we have our exit. Please let this be the last one, 20F. It just keeps going and going. There's another one I can't help, I'm sorry. Not only do I not have the item for it, but I already have you. Oh, I didn't even see that guy there. Well, there we go. George took him out, no problem. Oh, we got a Grimer. Not very effective, though. Yeah, it's getting progressively more difficult. Oh, nice. I might wanna do the same thing. No, not that way. <laughs> there we go, that's our last Iron Spike. Did it not land? Wow. Yeah, sometimes they just don't land, I guess. But luckily, we have the rocks as well, ow. 78 damage from that one, though, whoa. Am I out? I'm out, okay. Fine whip. And you wanna join us? Okay, you can actually join one of our things, though. So I definitely wanna get you. Uh, so who's the lowest level? The lowest level is probably, I mean, coughing or Arbok. The stats are better on the coughing, it seems, just from a quick glance. All right, well, we'll get rid of the Arbok now. Sorry, buddy. No, yeah, get rid of him. Well, actually, no, no, no. He's in a camp that I can actually put him in, I think. Yeah, so actually, I have to get rid of something like the Cloister or the Soul Rock, or the, let's do the Soul Rock right now. Don't want to get rid of a Pokemon I can keep. Almost did that. If I had a soul rock, I wish it would still get me some coins out. That'd be great. I just wanna find the exit now. Gotcha. Keep attacking. They're using Mud Bomb. Poor, poor Mike. You guys got him, right? There we go. And you got that box for me. Awesome. We gotta keep going. Yep, I'm, I'm sorry. I wish I could uh, save that one fainted Pokemon, but I have to keep moving. This has to end at some point, right? Oh my gosh. Let's go to our inventory and 
uh, register these. While well, everybody else is beating up the Sand Slash. There we go. You guys got him. Over this way, we have even more of those rocks, so I'll make the most of those. Aha, here we go. Go up, up, and then down. And we're moving. 22F. This is definitely the deepest we've ever gone. And also, I just there's many fours we've ever gone. We've never gone this high either. Okay, trying to get that guy. Turn around now. Throw a pebble at him. That's 30 damage. It's not a lot, but seeing how I'm trying to save my move powers, my power points, aha, we're getting really lucky with this now. Oh, there's a golem. I don't know how I feel about that, ouch! I just wanted to get those coins over there, but it might not be worth it. That was enough to take him out, very good. All right, we're going down. 23F. There's another one of these guys, I don't need to worry about it. But I am worried about where the staircase is. I hit you with the sludge bomb, it's not very effective, so I should just throw pebbles at you. Probably just as useful. Yeah, okay. Here's some coins, oh no. Get him if you can. Razor Leaf, super effective. Not enough to take you down, though. Ow, the rock throw is not good. I did see that there was a sparkling spot in this room. So yeah, grab those. I guess it was a Geo Pebble. Oh, actually, no, it was a Reviver Seed. Throw the rock at you. And there we go, I think we just gotta level up. That's at least something, yeah, we're level 35 now. Awesome. Oh no, a slow trap. That shouldn't be too big of a deal. There's no enemies, actually there's no other enemies on this floor right now. Weird. Okay, now they're starting to pop up. Do I even really care about the coins? I shouldn't. I should just get out of here. Yep. Oh, here we go. Oh man, we got the Genghis Khan here. I can deposit some items if I want. I can also withdraw some stuff. First, let's sort and get away the grimy food. Am I out of apples in general? It looks like it. Um, honestly, that's not that bad. It's just keeping all these seeds and stuff. I definitely don't need any of this out. So yeah, we'll do that. And then I'll also withdraw just a few apples. Um, three should be fine. I don't know if we'll be moving around a lot. Because I think that maybe we'll just be battling the next thing. Yep, I'd like to go on. Oh, I'm nervous. Magma Cavern Pit 24F. So there's still more to survive. But at least we get a nice restore with that. I do appreciate it. Okay, maybe we should try to beat up this guy. Critical hit, super effective one hit takedown. The Onyxes are a lot more scary. Oh, it's a Steelix. The evolution of Onyx, he's huge. Very scary. Will that really do much? I guess not. Fire Fang, ow. Throw a rock at him. That works pretty well. Throw another rock at him. Oh, he's using blind. Throw another rock at him. It's my only, my only strategy right now, just throwing a bunch of rocks. It's working though, sort of. He's got a lot of health. So this is where it becomes a big, big problem. He wants to join us? Oh man. We could take you. Yeah, I know, too many Pokemon. We have to say goodbye to somebody. Um, and we're going to say goodbye to somebody like Cloyster, I guess. Yeah, it should probably be Cloyster. Actually, Lunatone, because they're one level, or two levels lower. Yep. No, 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 that's what I wanted to do. Oh my gosh. I'm sure, I promise I'm sure. There we go. So we're hurting at the moment. The thing is that he can't really follow us around half the time. He's too big. So I don't know if that was worth my while. Oh no, he's gonna attack us without, ow, come on. Seed Bomb does 200 damage though. He's regretting that move. Actually, no, he is fitting down this little hallway now. Okay, he just has to like really squeeze through, I guess. Okay, here's an Onyx. We'll do Vine Whip, that's super effective as well. Doubling it up. And what was that? That was a Max Elixir. Okay, all I've done now is go in a big circle. Oh my gosh. Lots of stuff happening. I just wanna get out of here. 
Keep moving. The Steelix is fighting right now. That's what's happening. Okay, get rid of this Grimer. Oh, don't miss. I really need you to not miss right now. Wow. He, he's slippery or something. Uh, for right now, let's go ahead and have an Orenberry. Because we're just struggling to keep up with our health. That will definitely help. There's like an Onyx in between us and our Steelix. I feel bad. Uh, I guess I'll use a Tiny Reviver Seed. We need to go and help him, which is sort of frustrating. Because it's like, come on, dude. I'm trying to get over there. Uh, okay, he actually did survive it. He just had to pick a fight with everybody in the meantime. Oh my gosh, he faded it again from the from the flames, I guess. Okay, just stay back there and don't get taken out. Got another one of these guys. 76 damage, somebody else please hit him. There we go. There it is. So all I had to do was go to this way. Yes, I would like to move on. 25F. Oh boy. I oh know, I went the wrong way. This is the opening. Aha! Okay, very fortunate, very fortunate. It's just an immediate exit. Come on, what's happening now? We have like a giant party with us. Let's see. I wonder where we are. I know we've come pretty far. Whoa, whoa, quake! Whew, it settled down. Hey, zebra over there. Oh no, Charizard and uh, Tyranitar. Hey, snap out of it. Urgh. What happened here? We challenged Groudon and got wiped out. G Groudon? Urgh. We it crushed us. Wait, what about Alkazam? Where did Alkazam go? Alkazam is still battling Groudon. I wish I could help, but my body just won't cooperate. Zebra, we gotta hurry. Be careful. We'll be there as soon as we've recovered. Oh, Alkazam, are you okay? Hmm, so it's you. Stay back. This opponent is no laughing matter. Here it comes. Coming? Where? Oh no, from there, and there, and there, and there, and there, and there, oh no. <laughs> Watch out! Alkazam! Alkazam's gone. Was he maybe knocked out? Oh no. Darn it, it's our turn next. But I'm not going down without a fight. I'm very worried. Oh my gosh! It's yet another legendary Pokemon, Groudon. We're in trouble. Zebra hang tough. Whoa. He's got tiny little arms. <laughs> oh boy, but we have a whole team here. The okay abilities have been activated. The Earth moves violently. I don't know how that's gonna affect us as a Grass type. Well, we're all separated. Uh, it's a cataclysm. Magma is gushing out from the dungeon floor. The ground shakes and Pokemon will be moved. All Pokemon except for fire type Pokemon that touch the magma will get a burn. Okay. So I guess the green spots are where magma's gonna fill up. Okay. Everybody's attacking him. Hammer arm. Whoa. Yeah, I guess so. This magma's bubbling up from the ground. I just gotta get over there now. Cause you know, everybody else is going at him right now, it's awesome. I appreciate it, but I'm not quite over there yet. Oh, he's not happy. Oh, Arbok got blown away, but I should be fine. It just, it takes so long to get over. Cause everybody has to attack in that time. Magma is spreading. Oh, the water pole should be good. He has 71 damage, good job, George. Can I attack from here? I don't think so. Okay, so Grimer was just blown away. Yeah, I can't attack from here. <laughs> oh my gosh. I haven't even been able to hit him once. I mean, I hope he's he's confused now. He's taking some damage. Okay. Uh, let's see what we can do about this. Is this good enough? Am I close enough? 
I don't know, I haven't had a single chance to attack. Magma spreading, here we go, ready? Got him! 50 damage, yeah, all right. So I'll be ready for my next attack. He doesn't stand a chance. Oh, they missed, that's fine. They're standing on the lava to hit him now, I sort of feel bad. But he's confused, he's just constantly getting beat up. Come on now. Everybody keep at it, whoa! It missed him, nice, all right. I mean, it's not always a lot of damage. He's on fire. Groudon, magma disappeared into the ground. Very good, very good. 57 damage, that's super effective as well, but that is even more so. And there we go, we got him! I only attacked him like three times! Go team! He didn't like that very much now, did he? What do you know if you recruit like 30 Pokemon and just all attack him? Look, it's Alkazam! Charizard and Tyranitar too! Urgh. Yeah, we did it. Did you do it, Groudon? Are you all right? Yes, fine. We will be fine, but we must get out immediately. What about Groudon? Will it be okay? Your concern is unneeded. It will awaken soon enough. It had lost control only because it was enraged from having its sleep disturbed. It should calm down now. Uh, another quake? Ouch, quickly. I can't believe we just defeated Groudon. Sent him into a, a, a nice, nice nap. Having calmed Groudon, Zebra's team left the dungeon and return to Pokemon Square together with Alakazam's team. All right, Zebra successfully completed the rescue team at Mount Mar Magma Cavern Pit, and we get an orange berry and a rainbow gummy. All right, well that was a lot of fun. We also get Arbok, who is going to go into one of our camps, for sure. Uh, no nickname. We got coughing, they have riled up. Yep, go ahead and join our team. Very cool to see all this and Cloyster as well. We don't have a thing for him, so he just gives us a bunch of coins. And Grimer, yep. So three new Pokemon guaranteed, and I think two that we couldn't recruit. Or actually, no, Steelix as well. So four Pokemon, and we also got like what, three or four? We got three before, so we got seven Pokemon in today's episode, that's wild. And in the square. Is Zebra's team almost here? Look, here they come. It's true, darlings. Let's go. Yeah, where were they? I thought they were in the cave, but apparently not. None of these guys, we didn't see any of them. Great work, great work, Zebra. You really took down that crowd on? Darlings, it's fantastic. You've won me over. Whoa, wait a second. How does everyone know about what happened underground? Pelper spread the word with an extra edition of the Pokemon News. That Pelper is everywhere. You bunch became stronger than I expected. You can be proud of it. You lot did great. Why don't we team up sometime? <laughs> you, you've you earned everyone's respect now. Your team Zebra Herd is a first class rescue team. Take pride in that. George, Zebra. Zebra, this is great. All the work we put in, it's all, it was all worth it. Would you look at that? I didn't think someone that that could take down Crowdon would be such a crybaby. <laughs> There's nothing wrong with crying. It takes a really tough person to know when it's right to cry. Huh? What was that? I thought I heard something just for a moment. Did I just imagine it? Uh, no, I heard it too. Me too. Even now, I hear it. Someone talking? Not sure. Could it be? Th this voice. I remember this voice. This voice, I think. That's it, it's Zatu. Zatu? Ah, that's it, telepathy. Zatu is calling out to us using telepathy. To all Pokemon, calling all Pokemon. Terrible as it is, from the sky falls a star. From the sky comes a star. It's huge, a giant of a star. The star it falls, it falls straight to us. Uh-oh, that's a problem. That's a very big problem. Disasters in nature, there were many. The balance of the world, it has been upset. All because of the star, the star that slowly comes closer. 
If it keeps coming, it will crash into this world. It shall be terrible. Something must be done. Zatu, tell us, can the falling star be stopped? There is a way. To prevent collision, there is but one solution. You must ask Rayquaza. Rayquaza? What might that be? A Pokemon living far above us in the sky. Legendary it is. Rayquaza must be asked to destroy the star from the sky. However, Rayquaza is known by few and seen by none. The sky it calls home is above even the tallest mountains of this world. The sky? How are we, go how are we to go there? Alakazam and I amplify our teleport together and send Pokemon to the sky. However, the sky is a world above the clouds. What will become of the Pokemon sent to the sky? Even I can guess nothing. Then we'll do it, we'll go. I also, I thought there could be none but you. But are you sure? There's no telling what you could find in that world above the clouds. We expect danger. It's my wish that all Pokemon can live in peace. George, Zebra, do you hear? This is Zatu. Discuss we will, Alkazam and I, about the how our teleport can be amplified. Departure it is tomorrow. Rest you should until then. Last word, dangerous will be your adventure, but fail you must not, surpass yourselves. No problem, we'll be fine. Hey Zebra, let's get it done. So more challenges await us as we go into the sky and fight Rayquaza. What does George have to say? Zebra, are you all ready for the sky? Not yet, because that is something we will have to tackle in the next episode of Pokemon Mystery Dungeon Rescue Team DX. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye bye.